Well, bulldozers are out in Rajasthan with officials in Jaipur demolishing portions of a building from where a coaching institute that belongs to the main accused in the paper leak case was being run. Last month, the Rajasthan police had arrested over 50 people on the day of a teacher's recruitment exam after it was found that many candidates had accessed the paper before the exam began. The paper was subsequently postponed. Bhupendra Saran and Suresh Dhaka, the main accused in the case, ran the coaching institute which is being demolished by the Jaipur Development Authority. The Ashok Gelot's government's use of bulldozers comes just months after the Rajasthan chief minister had criticized the BJP government in Madhya Pradesh for demolishing the homes in Kargon where a clash had taken place. Let me now go across to our guests who are joining us on the show. Ashpreet Khadial, spokesperson of the Congress Party. Shailendra Singh Gurjar, BJP media panelist and uh, from Rajasthan. And uh, Shiv Shankar Parashar, he's a student, is also joining us here on the show. Coming first to you, Ashpreet Khadial. Is this uh, action that the Congress, Party, uh, the, the Congress Party government in Rajasthan has taken is under pressure because the BJP had been alleging that uh, the party is uh, uh, backing or at least uh, uh, trying to cover up the corruption case over here because uh, the action by bulldozers was criticized by Chief Minister Gelot himself when the incidents took place in Madhya Pradesh. One, that was an entirely different incident and this is an entirely different case that did not involve an illegal structure that did not involve you know two accused persons in a recruitment scam it had to do with a pelting it had to do with the pelting of stones so these two issues are very very different cannot be compared number two the people of rajasthan are hailing it embracing it appreciating it and in fact the bharti Janta party is appreciating this and saying you know that the properties of the accused should also have been attached number two attached uh, is uh, very different from demolishing a property no, 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 one one also second, the persons are, here are only accused they are not convicted. Number, number one, number one. It's hmm. not about them. It's about the illegally built structure. It was built illegally void ab initio. Then why was number an action two, taken earlier? No. Well, whenever it came to the fore, you know, whenever it was realized, an action was taken by the uh, Jaipur Development Authority. Number two, the Gulab Chand Kataria also did this. The Bharti Janata Party is leader from Rajasthan and it's not just the attaching of property that they asked, uh, appreciated or recommended. They appreciated the effort and the step that has been taken by the Rajasthan government. Number two, uh, you know, uh, it has to be taken into consideration that a notice was also sent. Four days ago, a notice was sent. There was no response to that. The accused persons in the recruitment scam did not even bother to reply to the notice or remove the encroachment, which was right over the road. Therefore, a legal action has been taken, which has been hailed by the people of Rajasthan, hailed by the opposition of Rajasthan and, in fact, by the people of India. But, you know, uh, Arshpreet Khadial, many would say that a dangerous precedent is being set here. You said a notice was served four days ago. There was no response, so the building was brought down. No action was taken earlier if this was an illegally constructed uh, building. Uh, Shailendra Singh Gurjar ji, uh, Congress ke yaha pravakta bol rahe hain ki BJP isse welcome kar raha hai step ko. Uh, kya aap ko lagta hai BJP ke pressure mein aake Congress ne ye kadam uthaya hai? डेफिनेटली uh, आप देखिए uh, अगर मैं आप पिछले पांच चार साल की बात करूं लास्ट पास्ट फोर इयर्स ऑफ द गवर्नमेंट गहलोत गवर्नमेंट रिजीम मोर देन 15 पेपर्स रिक्रूटमेंट एग्जाम पेपर्स हैव बीन लीक ऑफ स्टेट लेवल एंड डिस्ट्रिक्ट लेवल एग्जामिनेशन द पेपर हैज बीन लीक्ड एंड इन लास्ट फोर इयर्स द लॉ लॉ एंड ऑर्डर सिचुएशन हैज डिटेरेटरी बैडली एंड द कंट्रोल हैज बीन लॉस बाय द गहलोत गवर्नमेंट एंड अ न्यू माफिया Paper leak mafia has emerged in the Rajasthan, and you see the building they have emerged. No, no, but, but you believe that the action that has been taken by the government is correct? Uh, though they have to take stringent, uh, stringent uh, action against the main accused persons, but but I would like to emphasize on one thing: this building, the main accused have taken this building on rent, so. The owner of the building is different, and the mo both main accused persons are absconding from the law or from the police authorities, and they have not even seized 
their personal properties they have not demolished their houses not not demolished their so uh, you are not satisfied with the action you are saying that the action has been taken against the uh, wrong act person action has been taken if there is any violation of laws or bylaws what jaipur development authority was doing in last 4 years all I right would like to, that, that's the I question like i asked ashmit kadiali says that uh, it's Siddiqui, just come to light like so they demolished it now there is I'll, I'll, i'll ask you to sir yeah. hold on to your thoughts there let me go across to shiv shankar parashar uh, shiv shankar uh, aap kya is coaching institute mein the nahi ma'am main is coaching institute mein nahi tha lekin jo paper 24 december ko jo paper out tha Jee. wo paper main reh tha main jo hi pariksha hall mein exam dene pahuncha aur omr sheet baati gayi aur 10 minute baad vikshak dwara ye kaha gaya ki aapka paper out ho gaya hai aapki pariksha nirast hai ऐसा कहने से मैं बहुत दुखी हुआ निराश हुआ क्योंकि मैं पिछले छह महीने से जयपुर में रहकर कोचिंग कर रहा था और इस प्रतियोगी परीक्षा के लिए मैं पिछले दो साल से तैयारी में लगा हुआ हूँ 2020 से ही लेकिन जो ही पेपर लीक की सूचना मैंने सुनी मेरे को बहुत दुख हुआ कहीं कहीं सिस्टम और सरकार में कहीं कहीं नाकामी है सरकार सरकार अपने पिछले चार साल के कार्यकाल में एक भी परीक्षा भर्ती पूरी पारदर्शिता के साथ नहीं करा पाई सबसे बड़ी भर्ती दो में हुई थर्ड ग्रेड में बहुत घोटाला हुआ और उसमें लेवल टू में फिर परीक्षा को निरस्त किया गया और अभी पिछली भर्ती वन रक्षक हुई वो भी आउट हो गई थी और ये अभी 24 दिसंबर के मैं तो कहता हूँ सीनियर ग्रेड के सारे पेपर आउट हुए थे मतलब 21 से लेके 26 तक के सारे पेपर आउट हुए थे लेकिन 24 24 दिसंबर को जो पेपर आउट हुआ वही सामने आया बाकी तो सारे पेपर आउट। जी एक बात बताइए अब जो सरकार ने कदम उठाया है उस कोचिंग इंस्टीट्यूट जहां से पेपर लीक हुआ था उसको डिमोलिश करके आपको क्या लगता है कि ये सही कदम उठाया गया मैम ये कदम देखो कहीं कहीं सही तो है लेकिन केवल बिल्डिंग के ढहाने से ये चोरी नहीं रुक सकती है कहीं कहीं सिस्टम और सरकार में कहीं कहीं खामी है इसलिए ये बार बार पेपर इम्पोर्टेंट पॉइंट यू रेज आपको एक मिनट रोकूंगी अर्शप्रीत खडियाल He has raised a very pertinent point there, saying that this is a knee-jerk reaction. You've demolished that building, but that's not going to end the problems. The fault is with the system, and he's saying for the last four years, the people who are appearing for these exams have been hit by these issues. Definitely, <clears throat> see, uh, hundreds of thousands of people have been affected due to the leak, and therefore, people were saying the government should take an action. and we have taken an action and the people are appreciating it now as far as the political these go who are indulging into politics of convenience like the bharatiya janata party back when nothing was done the bjp was like why are you not doing anything now that an action has been taken some bharatiya janata parties especially the bharatiya janata party's leaders of rajasthan especially mr katari and i quote he said we are in favor of running bulldozers in such cases and here the spokesperson would like to differ Uh, it does not, you know, really uh, uh, amaze me because the Bharatiya Janata Party has always been confused. Number two, you know, for the people, it it comes out as justice, and for uh, as far as you know, the politics and the no, but I, I think concerned, Ashwin, they would you always, are uh, confusing. Always you are it. confusing issues there. The, you've just heard one of the students who appeared for mm -hmm. this exam saying that they do not see this as entire justice. The system needs to be fixed. Just Now, pulling down a building is no solution. Have has any of our leader from Rajasthan anywhere said that this is the only thing we are going to do? This is the tip of the iceberg. This is just the start. Everything is going to be cleaned out, and as far as the leaks are concerned, the cheating is concerned. Please refer to the data of Bihar, of Gujarat, of Haryana. Maximum states being run by the Bharatiya Janata Party has maximum number of leaks that have happened. So you Rajasthan you mean to say two wrongs make a right? Somebody. Since somebody never, else is also doing it, it's okay that, that it's happening did in Rajasthan. Did I, did I say that? I never said that. All I am saying is that we are willing. We have a strong will to you know do away with the leaks, with the cheating, with the corruption in the system. We'll do away with it. Okay. As far as the cases go. they are way more in the bharatiya janata party rural states and as far as this structure was concerned hmm. Hmm. you know it was a five story five story structure which was against the law number 1 and number 2 20 feet 15 feet and 10 feet long setbacks which have always amounted to you know violate the building bylaws in rajasthan so everybody knows it for a fact that legally we were, we are solid as far as justice goes we have started with justice 
and okay. it is not just right. the end it is the start to justice all right uh, one final comment there from uh, the bjp uh, spokesperson as well uh, mr shailendra arshpit khadial is saying this is only the start so don't uh, uh, you know just j- j- just be dismissive of the action that we've taken no i i want to tell to arshpit that uh, what you have quoted me i said the, uh, you have to take stringent action and you have taken but you have uh, not uh, seized and uh bulldozer the property of the main accused they are absconding and the last in last uh, four years more than 15 papers have been leaked and what the uh, state government is doing uh, this if there is any uh, violation of bylaws or any uh, rule then uh, jda should have taken action before that and one fact more i want to tell to our viewers that these these two main accused are also in the uh, they are accused in the uh, anm paper and constable paper they are also having consequences of leakage with two more uh, two more examinations before this one and a half year what the government of rajasthan is doing yellow government is sleeping they are not doing any action they have not taken any action they are only fighting for the uh, chair of cm ship i, All right. I would okay. like okay uh, like last last 30 seconds hello, 30 seconds left ashwin one thing the first one. point that was raised by him that the accused are still on the run see number 1 uh, number number 1 now now may I, may I please answer see first the gentleman from the bharatiya janata party has already acknowledged that yes it is an action that has been taken so thank you for that it rarely happens number 2 you know uh, the previous leaks that are concerned the culprits have been held of the previous leaks of the previous scams they are behind bars the cases are very close to conviction number 3 these are these two people who are absconding very soon they'll be held and they'll be given the okay. most stringent punishment of all, right. all time for all right let, let me take the last word from the strategy. student here because he's been impacted Very. the most in this case shiv shankar aap se aap bhi 30 second mein puchna chahenge ab aap sarkar se kya ummeed rakhte hain main sarkar se yahi ummeed rakhta hu mehnat karne wale chhatro ko nyay milna chahiye hai kyunki ye paper mafia paise deke naukri paana chahte hain lekin din raat mehnat karne wale chhatro jab ye sunta hai ek paper out ho gaya to ke परिवार वालों पर उन पे क्या गुजरती है मैं पिछले मेनी थैंक्स ऑल थ्री ऑफ यू फॉर ज्वाइनिंग अस हियर ऑन दिस डिस्कशन